would you say to like a young person that may be watching that is thinking of owning their own business? What's up you guys, this is Adana. So I am here at the health fair and I wanted to introduce you guys to Ashley and Junie. They are the owners, yes, these young looking females are the owners of Sapphire Health and Wellness. And so it is a, essentially a group home, but what, what are you, we're calling it Sapphire House. And so they own this business, they specialize in a particular disease, but I'm gonna let them talk to you about that. Um, you can just get a little bit of information from them. So tell me, what is your healthcare background? So my name is Ashley. I'm a registered nurse, so that's my background. Um, I started off uh, working in a nursing home as a nurse's aide, and I made my way um, up to the nursing. Um, and yeah, that's my background. So my name is Junie, and um, my background is more on the administrative side. So I did case management here in Ohio, um, and I worked with seniors um, with the Central Area Agency on Aging. So that's kind of how I got um, into it. So we kind of put those two things together. Oh, yeah. nice. So did you guys always knew that you wanted to start a business? I think we always knew we wanted to start a business. Yeah, I think um, life experiences brought us to this business, but I think we always knew that we wanted to do something entrepreneurial. And can you tell us a little bit about your business, about Sapphire House? Yeah. So Sapphire House is a residential care facility. Um, I, we like to compare it to an assisted living, um, but instead of it being such a huge facility, it's a small home setting. Um, so we take up to five residents. It's a two to five staff to resident ratio. Um, and we provide personalized care. So we do everything for them as far as like laundry, meals, um, anything that requires um, their care, we do. Also, um, we partnered up with our local um, Alzheimer's Association, so we provide um, education as a component of the work that we do in the community. We like to educate families who have uh, members who might be affected by the disease. So why Alzheimer's? Why did you guys choose Alzheimer's or partner up with the an association about Alzheimer's specifically? So me personally, like I said, I worked in a nursing home and I realized that people with Alzheimer's or dementia um, tend to be the ones that are left out. They can't speak for themselves, they need an advocate. And um, so at that point, I was drawn to them. Um, we've also been affected by the disease personally in our lives. We've had family members that have been diagnosed or were showing signs of the disease. So what is the one thing that you want people to know about Sapphire? The one thing that we want people to know is that we are passionate about making sure that the care that we provide is personalized to the individual. It's not, you know, an institutionalized setting where everyone's getting the same thing to eat or everyone has to do the same thing during these hours. We really love to learn about what the person's life was before they got dementia um, and then we try to create that atmosphere for them, even though they're in the dementia, even though they're, you know, battling the disease, we try to use as many things from their past to kind of keep them, you know, uplifted and to keep their quality of life. All right. Overall, we're creating a new standard for senior care. Sounds good. So, what will you say to like a young person that may be watching that is thinking of owning their own business? I would say um, educate yourself on whatever business that you're going into. Educate yourself on the rules, the laws, the regulations. Um, make sure you know everything that you need before really diving in. Um, that's one thing that I would say. I would say it is far from easy. Yeah. It's going to be hard. You just kind of have to keep pushing yourself until you get past, go past those obstacles. All right. Thank you guys so thank much. You. I really appreciate it. Again, um, be advocates for your patients, um, for your family members, and educate yourself. Those are the two things that I learned from these beautiful young ladies over at Sapphire House.